Christine, thanks for joining us. A Twin Cities family rocked by a double cancer diagnosis is struggling to accept what comes next. Last year, parents Jennifer and John Payton were diagnosed with different forms of cancer. And it's John who can't let go of how he might leave his family. WCCO's Jennifer Merrily reports on how you can help John accomplish a promise to his family. Everybody knows the cancer word can mean so many bad things. It's a word the Payton family heard too many times last year. September of 2015, I was diagnosed with breast cancer. Weeks later, John lost his job yeah. and then learned of his own kidney cancer diagnosis. That was even more devastating. We had surgery a week apart. Jennifer has been cancer free for a year. John's cancer spread to his lungs. And doctors told him there's no treatment, just medication that could slow the growth. In real words, I could have months. <laughs> <laughs> uh, months or some, you know some years. They had to have a real conversation with their sons. It's been devastating. It's it's really hard. It's yeah. scary. It's sad. It's the worst pain in the world, knowing that you're not going to be there for your wife and kids. And that's why John started a GoFundMe page at the insistence of friends, so that he, through the goodness of others, can give his family the stability he wants for them. I just don't want my wife or my kids' future to, to be jeopardized because of, you know, this illness. John had successful surgery after Thanksgiving to remove cancerous nodules. Doctors told him it increased his chance of living five years from 10% to 75%. We've added the GoFundMe information to WCCO.com slash links. And John's hope is to pay the home mortgage so when the time comes, his wife is able to support their family mm -hmm. on her own, Amelia. Frank. Gives your life some yeah. perspective for sure. It Absolutely. Does. Thank, Thank you, you, Jennifer.